What's up guys? This is Julie Zahn and I am ready to get in the ring with Mark Wahlberg, Christian Bale and Amy Adams at the premiere of The Fighter. If you don't fight, nobody gets paid. I think it's one of the most inspirational movies. You know, he's such an amazing guy. You know, he's so talented, but he's so humble. You know, it was, uh, it was something that we had to have done. How does it feel to have trained, you know, the real Mickey and Dickie, and now Mark Wahlberg and Christian Bale? Well, it, it, it was funny because I, I, I trained Dickie Eklund when he was in the Silver Mittens when I first got out of the service, 1968, and had him in the Silver Mittens. He won the championships. Mickey wasn't, uh, I think he was just born then, but never thinking about Mickey Ward, you know, and then as, as time goes on and life goes on, God has a plan, and you know what, it, it included me and included my wife and, you know, the, the friendship we had with Mickey and Dickie, and, and then, you know, the rest is history. Mickey Ward is 31 years old. He's here because he needs the money. Look at the size of that guy. He's got 20 pounds on me. I played uh, Mark Wahlberg and Christian Bale's father, uh, uh, a guy named Georgie Ward. And uh, it, it was great. I, uh, I had a father. I am not a father, uh, but I, I have brothers and siblings that I was able to uh, to tap in from uh, from some of the relationships I had with them. And it was uh, it was uh, not so much a challenge; it was exciting and, uh, and 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 a great and a wonderful thing to experience. I'm everything he knows. You don't know to see where this fight is headed. Start over. I'm still his trainer. Chris is fantastic, you know, I mean, I knew he was the guy for the part, you know, he's shown us what he can do when it comes to transforming physically, he's done it in the past, so, you know, it was uh, it was just a matter of whether he wanted to do it or not. Just, I uh, just happy just to be here, really, I mean, it's just, you know, getting invited to the premiere and he's excited about the whole thing, absolutely. Um, how did you guys, you know, find the story? What did you see in that before? Oh, actually, the story found me. I was introduced to the boxers and um, I was thinking about the story. I wasn't a big boxing fan back then, but I thought, well, let me let me check with Paul Tamasey and Eric Johnson, who were writers that I had worked with in the past. So I ran the story by them, and they flipped. And I thought, all right, let's do this. So we got the rights to them the very next back day. in 2003. Well, you know, this is it was a part of my life and my a moment in my life that uh, this movie is, is kind of based on, and uh, it's it's. It's surreal. It really is, you know, because that happened back in 1978. I fought Dick Eklund, and so it's kind of a, a weird thing. Uh, now there's, it's going to be placed on screen. I'm, I'm a fan of David O. Russell's. I'm a fan of Christian Bale's. My girlfriend's married to him. A fan of, you know, Mark Wahlberg. I. I can't wait to see what they do, a fresh new way of approaching the fighting film. And it's a you know real story, a true story. So the red carpet just finished, and it was a sparring match trying to get interviews with the celebrities. But we did get two questions in with Mark Wahlberg and some of the legends of boxing. So enjoy. This is Julie Zahn. I'm knocking it out. Mickey has a chance to do something that I never did, and he needs me. OK, I'll see you in Mickey's corner. This is your time. I haven't been coming my blue. You don't have to. You don't make it why. You don't make it why. <laughs> <laughs>